London, London is a place where you will see a lot of different communities. That's the reason I always try and consider a lot of food, a lot of signature dishes. Indian food has a lot of depth, so we have to consider, you know, different palate as well. So I've got a few offerings from South India, few from North India, few from West as well. So I'm trying and incorporate most of the signature dishes across from India. Kulcha Wamli, it's uh, located inside the box park in Wamli. The location is fabulous. There's a stadium, less than 100 yards, and a lot of footfall. We have done a 65 cover sitting restaurant, and it's more semi casual style setup. Yeah, Kulcha is uh, one of the flatbread, very well known in North India. So we are just trying to incorporate a lot of things like sandwiches, stuffed bread, or uh, grilled sandwiches. So more focus on kulcha and iced teas. I always uh, try and use lots of local produce and of course uh, according to the UK season as well. So on an average, every quarter, the season uh, will always be changed, few things. So I always try and, you know, change the menu roughly 30 to 40 percent. It's my, you know, routine practice. So it happens every quarter at my both restaurants. I try and put a lot of focus on North India. The reason why is I grown up in a Punjabi family. So, of course, I spend more, most of the time in North India. And of course, uh, the flavors are, you know, different. In this area, people love to have a spicy food as well. My mother, she is a very good cook actually. And uh, I got inspired through her cooking. And my brother, he's a celebrity chef in uh, Dublin. After spending seven or eight years with the big hotels in India, Taj Hotels and Oprah's Hotel, I decided to move on. So I came over late 2007 with the Chef Atul Kocha at Panaras. Then after spending a couple of years with him, I moved on with the JKS restaurant group as a corporate chef. I always look for, you know, something different and creative side. So I grabbed the opportunity to open a Jamawa restaurant in Mayfair again. After the success of Jamawa in Bombay Basal, I decided to open my own place. So finally, I found another, uh, my own side in Chelsea. It's a fine dining restaurant. It's called Kutir. After uh, the Kutir opening, we found this site inside the box park in Wembley. So we decided to do one fine dining and one comfort food concept. The culture is uh, more focused on uh, comfort food. So I always uh, try to keep balance basically in the fine dining and comfort food as well. I personally loved it. The reason why is that it has a lot of quirky flavors you know, rustic and quirky flavors. So I don't mind doing both 